Who is it? Ann. You'll get your heat. I sent the guy up. Uh, can I talk to you? All right, come on in. And make it quick. I'm leaving on the next tide. <laughs> Puerto Rico, huh? You know, wait a minute. Just wait a second. I mean, don't think that this has anything to do with her. I've just been taking a good look at my life, you know? And I've been stuck here in a rut for 14 years. It's time to move on, time to make a few changes, time to have a little fun. I ain't broke, you know. I mean, bachelors, we don't spend money. We save. We save money. And we wait. For the right woman. Ms. Romano, why did she have to turn me down? Ah, uh, Dwayne, I guess she just isn't ready for marriage. She's ready for marriage. She's not ready for me. Hey, come on. You are not the first man to ever be turned down, you know. Yeah, but not in front of the guys! Dwayne, she really likes you very much. Oh, yeah, sure, I can tell. Oh, Dwayne. I'm gonna tell you something. I'm gonna find this hard to believe. But certain aspects of my reputation as a lover, as a big lover, are slightly over proportioned. Oh, I know that. <laughs> well, uh, I mean, what I mean is that none of us are completely irresistible. Hey, I seem to remember a certain cute little uh, student nurse in 317 who kept uh, inviting you in. You want to know the truth about that cute little student nurse in 317 after the door was closed? Oh, no, you don't have I'll to tell you. She led me into a bedroom. She got me in bed. And she practiced changing sheets. <laughs> you talk about striking out. <laughs> Why, when I was going to high school, my first dance, you know how I brought to my first dance? I brought me, and that's who I took home. Oh, oh. <laughs> Do you want to know what I did at my first three high school dances? I ran the spotlight. Oh, come on, a cute little redhead like you. You must have had a million dates. I wasn't cute, and I wasn't a... I wasn't cute. <laughs> We all go through periods of time in our lives when, when we feel that nobody wants us. Yeah, but we don't pretend it was somebody else. Ah, uh, you don't have to pretend you are somebody. Oh, nice try, but I'm not a dummy. Look, Mr. Romano, this is hard for me to say, but I... I mean, I sense that occasionally there wasn't a genuine romantic feeling between you and me continuously. Oh, <laughs> now... So, what I'm... What I'm asking you is, can you be my friend? Oh, yeah, sure, of course. All right, then, as a friend, please, what is it about me that she hates? That's stupid. I'm stupid. No, no, you're wonderful and you're a terrific super. I'm talking about me as, an, as a man. Now, what is it about me that turns her off? You don't turn her off. Well, why do I turn you off? You don't turn me off. Well, you said I do. No, I didn't say that, you did. Well, what turns you on? <laughs> You're handsome. Go ahead. <laughs> You're masculine, manly. I, I really, I mean that. You believe that? Yes. You're masculine and you're you're strong, virile. <laughs> Sexy? <laughs> well, in your own way, you do have a certain sex appeal. That's true. <laughs> you really want me, don't you? Wayne. And. Schneider! Ginny, hide in the bathroom! No, I won't! <laughs>